Welcome to another Firearms and Safety YouTube. Just wanted to get this uh, in front of you guys. This is the Cat DD. They're Dirty Dave. This is a quick first impressions. Um, so yeah, just wanted to go over a couple things. The weight, the uh, SIG taper end cap, uh, how easily this can scratches. Um, it's, it scratches very easily. Uh, I have not even shot this yet. So... Uh, I put an SD rail over it, but I was pretty careful. But uh, if you do ever get a chance to use one of these, just, you know, make sure you take note of that. But this is about six inches. This is uh, the mill version, which you can see from this line right here. Uh, it's a 762 suppressor meant for 12 to 13 inch 308, specifically that uh, MCX spear. And then we're just going to throw it on the scale here for you just so y'all could see the weight. This is the titanium hub version, and uh, there are actually different versions of this. They have this in 718 Inconel. They have this in their own. This is the TI-64 that's proprietary to CAT. And they also have, um, you know, the mill version, which is basically, they have the Alley Cat version, then the mill version. Alley Cat is basically a better coating uh, with uh, different geometry inside. You could purchase that version. Uh, the mill version is simply the uh, couple weaker points that are just reinforced. So um, overall, you know, I think it's pretty neat. Um, it's not, not too heavy, but I did, uh, you know, I thought this would be a little lighter, uh, but once I put this on my host, it really didn't matter because uh, basically, it's so short. I mean, it's literally just above six inches. You got the built-in flash hider. And um, yeah, so I'll have a full review. Going to be doing some testing with some 300 Blackout Supers. I'll do this with some subs. I'm not going to run this through 308 quite yet. Um, but yeah, ultimately, just wanted to get you guys a quick preview of what the Cat Dirty Dave looks like. Thank you for your time. Stay tuned.